For this week's Sports Star Spotlight, we're headed to Texas, where Joe McCann introduced us to one of the country's best shortstops. In the ever-growing Dallas-Fort Worth area, new high schools are popping up all the time. Denton Braswell is one of the newer names on the north side of the Metroplex. So this is the sixth year Braswell. Braswell opened six years ago. You know, originally it started out with about 1,200 students, and so right now we're pushing 3,000, so uh, a lot of growth. Jason Jones is one athlete helping to put Braswell on the map. His older brother Jordan was part of the school's first graduating class four years ago and is now a pitcher at Arkansas Pine Bluff. Both of his parents played college sports, his mom basketball and his father baseball. So being in an athletic family, Jason always wanted to be an athlete of some sort. I was never wanting to sit sit down and watch cartoons or something like that. I always wanted a ball in my hand. I always wanted to go and, uh, go and hit a little bit extra, want to go and throw something. My brother was also a person who helped me out a lot with that because he was kind of going through the sports as well. And I was that little brother right behind him, like, hey, let me, let's go, let's go. He wanted to be a part of all the sports he could be a part of. So I put him in basketball, football, and baseball at a very young age. So I was pretty good at football. I wouldn't, wouldn't say I'm the best, but I was pretty good at football. And uh, it was a tough decision to choose either one. But I always knew that baseball was my calling and my passion. Um, and I knew that's where my heart wanted me to go. Jason is now one of the highest rated shortstops in the country for 2022. Just watch him play or work out for a bit, and you can see why. Part of it is the eye test. I mean, he's he's a big kid, 6'2", you know, over 200 pounds, and can move. He hits the ball. His his exit velocity, his his numbers, just raw numbers, just kind of are off the charts. But not just that, the personality, the the, the work ethic, just uh, the leadership qualities that he has. I think he's a a, a five tool player to me. Um, he can hit. For, for average, he can hit for power. I mean, he has running skills, he ran a 6.560. His glove work has improved tremendously. I think he's at a D1 above level to pro level now. Um, and he has an arm, you know, he's 94 across the diamond and there's nothing that he doesn't have. And I think he has a six tool too, because he's got the IQ that he's had ever since he was little. While he can do it all, he's especially wowed scouts with his sweet swing and disciplined approach. The ball just sounds different coming off his bat. Personally, what I love is uh, middle, middle away, trying to drive the ball over the second baseman's head. But uh, so what kind of started to happen is I started to get a little bit with quicker pitching. I was a tad bit late. So I kind of flipped my uh, approach, still middle, middle away, driving the ball back up the middle, but staying gap to gap, which made me feel the most balanced, the most comfortable in the plate. During BP, he's, he's very he has a very professional approach. And so a lot of kids with that kind of power, they want to come out and just, it's just home run derby. But that's not how he approaches batting practice. He definitely can. I mean, he can come out here and, you know, put five, six, seven, you know, out uh, when he wants to. But he also understands what the team needs and what's going to help him improve as a baseball player and help our team win. The work never stops for Jason, whether it's making adjustments to his swing or becoming the best he possibly can at shortstop position he loves to play. Well, I love shortstop because you kind of have a control of the field. I just like all the action that it has with it. Uh, I just like how everything is fast paced. Um, you have to really range up and get to balls. You have to be moving. You have to be paying attention. The IQ level has to be higher. He's worked on things that you may not think about, uh, you know, his defense, his arm strength. He's improved as a base runner. Uh, he's just improved the, uh, the areas around his game. Most people know about him as a hitter. He's improved the little things too uh, that, that a lot of people don't don't look at and that's just being a, a better overall ball player. He may hear his name called in this summer's Major League Baseball draft, but he's truly looking forward to a college career with the Arkansas Razorbacks. Whether it's soon or five years from now, Jason wants to be a major leaguer, but that's just the start of his long-term goals. I just know that the work wouldn't stop there though. That's definitely a goal of mine, but that is not my main goal. I'm not ever really truly going to be satisfied. But I know for a fact that that's, that's just not where the work stopped. It doesn't stop there. There's always a step that you need to take. There's always uh, something that you need to push. I'll say my ultimate dream ever since I was three years old was to be a first battle Hall of Famer. That, that, that's always been my dream. Whatever path uh, that God has placed for me is whatever path that I'm willing to take. Wherever he is will be the best place for him. And so he's obviously getting a ton of, you know, ton of looks. We've got scouts come to, to games, practices. They, they want to see him. And, uh, and so the thing is, is he's handled that really well. I'm, and I'm excited for him to just go live his life and be happy and figure out where, what his path is going to be. I think Jason's going to do something great. I don't know where, but I'm excited for him. I think he'll be a big leader, whether he goes to college or whether he goes straight you know, to the minors out of high school. It's going to be fun to watch that journey. In Aubrey, Texas, I'm Joe McCann. Thanks for checking out Sports Stars of Tomorrow on YouTube. If you enjoyed this video, 
please be sure to give it a like and please subscribe to our channel so you see all of the latest content.